apply for nursing jobs in Saudi Arabia. The Kingdom of Saudi Arabia remains a popular destination and place to work for nurses and other members of the medical profession, due to high levels of investment in medical services and the excellent packages on offer in the Kingdom. The Saudi Arabian healthcare system is a national healthcare system, with private services growing alongside the public system. You will find in both workplaces cutting-edge equipment, internationally accredited facilities, and diverse staff lending their expertise, from all corners of the world. There are many opportunities to further your career in these facilities. Arabic language skills are not essential, unless you are working mental health or some areas of pediatrics, however it is always beneficial if you do have some level of proficiency. Expatriate staff are usually housed on site or in a private housing complex, also called a compound. Some of these have additional facilities such as pools and tennis courts. Your employer will provide for your housing among other benefits. Living in Saudi Arabia offers many opportunities to visit historical sites and experience a culture which is often misunderstood. Locals are well known for their hospitality and are welcoming to expatriates. Nurse Registration Process in Saudi Arabia Saudi Arabia It is the largest Gulf country. Saudi Commission for Health Specialities, SCFHS, is responsible for evaluating and classifying all health-related degree holders before permitting them to practice in the kingdom. Every health professional including nurses who likes to work in Saudi Arabia has to get registered under SCFHS. Saudi Arabia is the only Gulf country where you can give the exam, after joining the work in Saudi Arabia, provided you clear the exam within a year. With a maximum of three attempts. Failing to succeed within these three attempts will make you, not eligible to work in Saudi Arabia, in case you take in the first two attempts and succeed in the final attempt, you need to succeed one more additional attempt within a year. SCFHS partnered with Prometric, the reputable U.S. company, with great experience in computer-based tests CBT test delivery locally, regionally and internationally conducts the licensing exam tour nurses. This exam can be taken in all Prometric test centers across the world. The Prometric exam comprises 70 questions, with 2 hours duration and you need a minimum at 60% marks, to pass the exam. SCFHS provides the convenience of viewing the result, and the number of questions answered immediately. Licensing is a four-step process, as follows. 1. Data Flow Data Flow is a third-party company used by the SCFHS to verify your education, professional license, and employment documents. Upload all of your documents to Dataflow, and pay the Dataflow application fee. The process can take up to two months to complete. Once your Dataflow verification report has been issued, you can then proceed to Step 2. 2. Professional Classification and Licensing Exam SCFHS is the online application system into which you enter all your details, and upload documents. Checklist of documents, the SCFHS will then review your application to determine your eligibility for licensing Saudi Arabia. If you are deemed eligible for licensing, you will be issued an eligibility number, which allows you to register for the licensing exam. Everyone must write the Prometric or Pearson VUE licensing exam before relocation. The approx fee for the nursing Prometric exam is 239 US dollars. 3. Professional Classification Certificate Once you have passed the licensing exam, the SCFHS will complete a final review of your application. Once approved, you will be issued a Professional Classification Certificate. 4. Professional Registration The registration process is completed when you arrive in Saudi Arabia. List of Documents Required for SCFHS Registration Complete the professional classification and registration form.
notarized identification letter showing the date he or she started working and his or her job title, and certifying that he or she holds his or her position to date. Copy of the current registration, a copy of his or her qualifications, a copy of his or her qualifications transcripts, birth certificate, in English only, internship certificate, if available. Certificate of registration, if available, or board certificate for practitioners who studied in their country, basic life support certificate, copy of passport and residency, two recent personal photos. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more videos.